store shelves are empty yet this again. This surge in gas prices lingers Massive on. Massive staffing challenges that have reignited. Every time I tank up, everywhere I go, the prices are up and up and up and up. We're just sick of what's going on in the state, and we hope we can, you know, get back to our freedom. We all know it's been a tough few years, but one thing we've learned here in Massachusetts is that we're tougher. My name is Jeff Deal, and I'm running to be your next governor. I'm a man who's devoted my life to my family, our business, and fighting for what's right for the people of the state. You wanted to go up automatically without a vote. When I was your state rep, and I ran to be your senator, I fought to keep taxes lower, especially at the pump. How does that impact your family budget? But it seems lately that those in power, they don't care about the price of gas. Every little bit that you use to fill it up. Or food. Something that gets taken away from your family. Or whether our businesses stay open. It would definitely put me out of business if I don't come up on the prices. Or our police. I was terminated on April 8th, 2022. Or even keeping kids in school. And I come here today to demand that you change your mask guidance for our children. This is not about freedom. We don't need politicians telling us what to do. We need to be telling Beacon Hill what they need to do. Gas prices have hit a record high. For crying out loud, they wouldn't even cut our taxes at the pump when we've had billions of dollars in new tax revenue. The nays have it. The amendment is not adopted. And while those in office argue and fight, our country is crumbling like our pothole-ridden roads and bridges. We need to be in a state where people can live and not leave. A commonwealth that is run by the people for the people. Our country was founded by people who fought for their freedom and a better life, and they won. Creating a land of opportunity for the free and the brave with justice and equality for all. That's the American dream. What we need is someone who's interested in solving our problems and not creating more. For decades, I've fought in making Massachusetts the best state in the country. Creating laws to help people and not hurt them. Fighting for families cheaper gas and for stronger laws to put career criminals behind bars. It's time for us to turn a new page and it's time for us to put the needs of our people first once again. I have faith in Massachusetts and now I'm asking for you to have faith in me.